All right, AP and advanced. Um, today, you guys, I'm sharing a video with you guys about the idea of coloring or shading uh, using coffee. And I'll let that kind of all explain itself. Um, but if you're looking for kind of a cool um, sepia tony, like monochromatic uh, shading method, you guys, this is, this is actually really kind of fun. Um, Mr. Van Gelder and I talked about this a few weeks ago. He's going to do some stuff with his classes using it. Um, and I'm obviously like going to put it out there as well. I'm actually going to have um, my Drawing One kids do an entire um, project, this project that they're currently working on. They're going to do shading um, with the coffee. But um, the video that I'm sharing with you guys kind of give you a little bit of a, a handle like on how that's going to work. Um, but you guys should experiment with it. Give it a try. Um, if you've got coffee in the house, I'm not a coffee drinker. I actually had to go buy some instant coffee or whatever to like create my sludge that I use for shading. Um, but like kind of a fun thing for you guys to play with. So anyways, you guys today, um, maybe I want to encourage that. I'm not, uh, for AP kids, uh, I have not gotten any feedback from you guys, from any of you since the first week. And so, um, there's maybe like three or four of you that still technically are enrolled in the class. If you're planning on doing the exam um, and still doing a portfolio, uh, which was like two of you, um, you guys gotta let me know, all right? If you're not gonna do that, then I'm just gonna continue to kind of like encourage you to be making projects. But you guys, if you're not gonna do uh, the portfolio, like I just need to know, and like we need to like try to get your money back. Um, so that was just for AP Advanced. Um, you guys, again, like I, I mentioned this yesterday, um, some of you are starting to create uh, new products or coming up with new ideas um, based on the fact that you already were working on something and now you're moving, like you're done or almost done and you need to work on something else. So you guys, you should be letting me know that you're finished, show me your final work and daily share, and then you guys should be throwing out new ideas. All right, so I kind of know where each of you is at. Um, make sure that I'm getting that understanding or make sure that I'm seeing like where you guys are. So everybody good? All right. If you guys have questions, let me know and I will talk to you guys later. Hey guys, one other quick thing. Um, I'm going to do a daily check-in, uh, where you guys can chat live with me. Um, I'm going to do this for all my classes at the same time. Like I, to be completely honest, like do not have um a ton of kids that are participating right now and so like it doesn't really make sense for me to like do different segmented times um but what it does make sense for me to do right now is to have like kind of a, a group chat time um i'm thinking let's just make it easy and just do like at 10 40. i think that will get you guys like i know it's kind of a random time but like that's when your normal four classes should be done so from 10 40 to 11 um, I'll do that chat time uh, if you guys need it. Um, we'll put the, the code up or whatever you guys can bounce in. And yeah, like so just if you want to chat for 20 minutes, if you want to just hang out, um, that's awesome. Otherwise, uh, this is, yeah, it's not mandatory, um, but it's a good place if you have questions or whatever, you can do that. So 1040 to 11 o'clock every day. Um, check in with me if you guys want to. And we'll go from there. So anyways, guys, I hope you guys are doing good. And I will talk to you tomorrow.